Hey everybody, my name is Nina. And I'm Dr. Melvin. Welcome to Wine with Melanin. I hope you all got your glass. Let's go. And you're ready to talk and chat with us. <laughs> we are so excited to be starting yes, this YouTube yes, channel. You know, we've been asked to do it for so long now. Oh, let me get my chain on since you got your chain. <laughs> we've been asked to do it for so long now and then, you know, we're we're excited about letting people into our world and you know we just want to talk about why we wanted to let people into our worlds i feel like oftentimes you see people they come out with a new youtube channel and they All dive the right in yep so for us we were like let's you know let's just tell them the why why did we decide to do this youtube channel and just our thoughts about youtube and it's like opening ourselves up to you guys all right well from from me i guess to start on my end i think this is a it's a wonderful experience I'm nervous. <laughs> I'll be honest with you. I don't know how much to let people in because it's as social media goes, I'm still very much private. Right. But what I do get in a lot of messages via um, Instagram is a lot of I didn't know there was, um, I, uh, I guess, a lot of my youth or or others who are younger than myself who need advice and guidance. And I get a lot of DMs regarding career paths and what should do. And we all have pitfalls. And sometimes people just need a quick pick me up or just advice. So it was a it was a good outlet through Instagram. So and we had an impromptu moment where we put up a video and a lot of these questions just flew right over. So right. I decided they requested it and after like a here crazy we are. night of like drinking, having fun, we were like, Let's come home and let's go live. <laughs> yeah. And we went live and, and it was like it was, two AM. It was and a all lot of you of guys questions. were there. And so we were like, We gotta do this. And I didn't yeah. even know I didn't even know that this was like something that people would be so receptive to. So right. we just wanna keep it going. Right. And for me, um, I get a lot of questions like, Oh, can you be my mentor? or questions like how, things about law school, things about my relationship, things about just being a woman of God. Uh -huh. So for me, it was super important to do this because I felt like, yeah, it's actually okay to, you know, speak to people. It's okay to advise people. It's okay to try to be there for people. It was so weird to be asked to be a mentor because like <laughs> me, myself, I'm looking for a mentor. Or I feel like I, I need a mentor, you know, just to help guide me through life. So for other people to ask me to be a mentor, I used to ask like, am I even qualified for that? I would ask Obi like, oh my God, somebody asked me to be her mentor. What should I say? And he's like, say yes. Like you have the qualities of being a good mentor and you're very supportive of people. And I think that's what brought us here. Obi and I, we just love to give back to the community. We love to, you know, extend our hand where we can. So it's just a blessing to be here doing this with you guys. Um, exactly, exactly. As you guys know, there are a lot of, like when you open up yourself to the world, a lot of scrutiny could come from that. So I feel like for years we had a lot of fear about this. We have been offered television opportunities. Um, we even started the process for some of our television opportunities and we just realized that we kind of wanted to be in control of the narrative of us. Exactly. We never want anybody to manipulate how we are portrayed because we are definitely people of morals and dignity and we never want that to be construed exactly. or misconstrued on television. Yes, yes. And just to piggyback of what she was saying as far as I'm a mentorship, I would say even myself, that, um, I have people who um, who mentees and mentors. What I mean by that is whatever platform you are in life, there's always someone above you and someone below you. Mm -hmm. So you reaching down is to help pull someone who sees you higher up to pull them to your level. And in the same sense, in the same breath, you look up and find someone who's above you, who you can look to guide you along the way. You know, there's always someone ahead. If, you know, no one got anywhere they are without without someone getting them there. So definitely, I think at any point in time, it's an honor for someone to ask you to be their mentor. Mm -hmm. In the same way, it's just seeking guidance along the way in this thing called life you know and there's nothing wrong with becoming somebody's mentor yep. when you're yourself looking for or have mentorship exactly so I de I'm definitely learning that and I'm happy <laughs> to be people's mentors now there you go um I guess the question I always ask is what do you need mentoring in but just DM me and we'll see so but yeah so getting back to um like our dignity our morals kind of thing um, we are private, like private public people, yes. right? You yes. know, we love the fact that people see us outside and they recognize us. They come, they say, oh my God, we follow your Instagram. You guys are awesome. 
Um, but at the same time, we love the fact that people don't really know much about what happens in the confinement of our home. Exactly. Even though nothing crazy really happens behind closed doors <laughs> besides laughing and joking. Yep. But um, we just want to say, like, although we are opening ourselves to the world, we're opening up ourselves to our followers and, like, this whole YouTube thing, um, there's a respect level that we always want to maintain yes. from us to you guys or from you guys to us. And we just ask that, you know, throughout this whole thing, for however long it lasts, that respect level um, remains at all times. And we're we're always open. Trust me, I have got some crazy questions, and so has OB. Yep. So we're definitely always open to answering questions. Um, but we just... Have at it. Yeah, <laughs> like seriously. But, you know, I think there's boundaries to everything, you know. And sometimes we just have to be... Co um, what's the word? Cognizant. Cognizant. Yeah, cognizant. 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 See, that's the yin to my yang. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes we just have to be cognizant of what we're asking and whether or not it may or may not affect or offend somebody. And I exactly. think we're humans. We make mistakes. So don't feel like, oh, if, you know, we're like, you know what? I'm not comfortable answering that. Don't feel that like that in any way that you have done anything wrong. But, you know, life is a learning process and a growing process. And Sometimes you have to kind of heal before you can answer certain things or something, yeah. certain things like uh, struck, struck, strike a chord. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. So, you know, this is our first video and we definitely want you guys to get a little bit to know, uh, get to know us a little bit. So, um, do you want to do like a quick, like intro background of who you are? And then I can. All right. Well, um, I was initially going to say after watching the video, definitely comment below mm -hmm. and leave any questions you want to, uh, you know, anything you would like to know, questions you felt that were unanswered. Like, subscribe, like, subscribe and share, <laughs> like, subscribe. <laughs> Like, subscribe, and share. There you go. <laughs> and uh, definitely let reach out. Let me know about any questions you would like to know about myself, my wife, or about us um, as a whole. But um, about me, I guess to say everything else, I'm Nigerian. We're Nigerian. Um, I was born in Nigeria, of course. Came I was here. Born in the Bronx. <laughs> came here in the in the, middle, in the 90s, and um, from a large, large family family of physicians. Um, where sh what more should I add? into it um your birthday i'm a scorpio Woo! <laughs> scorpio um, november 17 198x <laughs> <laughs> um what else should i add that um that i don't know what more what should i add why do you say 198x x is 10 I know, no, 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 no. X is like Malcolm X. You don't know. It's like black. Oh, yeah, okay. I could be 81 or I could be 89. Got Mind it. Mind your business. <laughs> See, I'm learning something new about him too. <laughs> That's how it goes. All righty. So for me, my name is Nina. As you guys know, I am a Virgo, Nigerian, American, born in the Bronx. Yes. Um, <laughs> I have moved several places since then. I am currently in law school. Obi is a pediatrician. Uh, you know? see, I, I'm very, a lot of things about me are modest. I've, like, mm -hmm. I've been in circles where people throw around their careers, mm -hmm. throw on their titles. And I'm just like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You be forgetting you're <laughs> and, a doctor. You know how many times at work they've called me to re-sign a, a, a transfer or a medical paper and they're like sir could you just add your md at the end of it i was like oh. <laughs> and like it always happens when i get it and i just write my first name last name and move on or i sign it they're like just write the md or just stamp it right. and i don't really wear my white coat but i still try to be you know the only time you pull these things out is if someone is trying to like as they say upstage you or someone's trying to show you out then i'll let them know like listen no he just be forgetting he's a doctor <laughs> okay he is a pediatrician. He works here in Prince George's County, Maryland, and he also had, um, that's his private practice, and he also works in the ER in yeah. Howard County, um, Maryland. Yeah. So, like I said, I'm in law school. I'm in my second year of law school. We sometimes joke around and say we the Nigerian Huxtable. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, and yeah, Obi, one word to describe him is definitely just amazing. I definitely love my... <laughs> fiance slash husband um i love being around him i love spending time with him i love everything about him and i'm excited to embark on this journey with you baby me too me too melanin 2020 so yes so yeah we didn't even tell them melanin we're getting 20. married we are getting we're married so used because we think September. this is like all of our regular followers yeah. but we're definitely getting married yeah so we're getting married in september and 
this YouTube channel will also like follow that journey. That's why we put like the little teaser of our uh, engagement. engagement photo yeah, after he proposed and I got the brain. Hold on. <laughs> Woo! So yeah, um, this, our channel is gonna really focus on that and there'll be a lot of aspects of our engagement on our YouTube channel and the build up and, and then the wedding, prep, the wedding prep, and the man. videos. And, oh my God, everything's gonna Lots be more to awesome. Come. A lot more to come. So, Definitely stay tuned for everything. Tune in, Yep. Um, support us, love on us, and we just hope to grow in this journey with you all. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you guys.